Turkey's state-controlled missile maker Aketsan has developed a supersonic anti-radiation missile for the Khan jet fighters, the country's indigenous fighter jet in the making. The missile, Dubik Baba or Vulture in English, was included in the ammunitions list of the Khan at a Turkish Air Force briefing on June 30. The Akbaba program is classified, and Raketsan's website does not mention the technology. The Akbaba project is very secretive, so very little information is known to the public for national security, reasons Raketsan told Defense News on July 8. But a company official, speaking on condition of anonymity, said the Akbaba missiles will replace the batch of about 100 AGM-88 HUM missiles in the Air Force's inventory. American firm Raytheon Technologies builds the AGM-88 arm, which is also a high-speed anti-radiation missile, used to seek and destroy radar-equipped air defense systems. An Air Force official said the Akbaba will be used by the 151st Bronze Squadron, a unit that specializes in using the harm weapons when operating F-16 CD fighting Falcons. A defense procurement source said the contract value for the Akbaba is unknown because quantity has not been determined. We have about 100 AGM-88 arms, which will be replaced by the Akbaba. That would make a contract of about $50 million. But we may have follow-on orders bigger than the original, he said. This is an open-ended program. The official also said the final quantities and the contract value will depend on the progress of the Khan Fighters Jet program. An anti-radiation missile, ARM, is a missile designed to detect and home in on an enemy radio emission source. Typically, these are designed for use against an enemy radar, although jammers, and even radios used for communications, can also be targeted in this manner. The earliest known anti-radiation weapon is a variant of the Blohm and Vosby V246 radar-guided bomb.